other foods like insulin and IGF-1, and IGF-1 stands for insulin-like growth factor 1. It's called insulin-like because it binds to the insulin receptor. It's also growth a powerful growth-promoting hormone, and higher levels are linked to more higher rates of cancer, especially breast cancer and prostate cancer. So what promotes higher levels of insulin is the glycemic load of your diet. The glycemic load means how fast the glucose enters the bloodstream. If I eat, let's say, enough beans to give me 100 calories of carbohydrate, which the body's going to eventually turn into a glucose, it's going to come into the bloodstream at about one calorie a minute. It's going to take about three hours to come in, so that's about one calorie every two minutes. The bean glucose only comes in one calorie every two minutes. The body hardly needs any insulin to deal with one calorie coming in every two minutes. But if I took that piece of white bread, I'm going to get 50 calories a minute coming in. Then your body needs a higher amount of insulin in response to that.